If you're facing the prospect of a visit from a magistrate court bailiff, you'll likely be wondering if you can prevent them from entering your home. Keep watching to find out what you can do to protect yourself. The magistrate court is responsible for issuing criminal fines and enforcing council tax debt. If you fail to pay your council tax arrears by the reminder dates provided by the council, they can ask the magistrate court to intervene. The court will then issue a liability order, which is a legal demand for you to pay the council tax debt, including additional costs to cover the council's legal expenses. Magistrate court bailiffs are approved enforcement agents authorized to serve court documents, enforce magistrate court judgments, and execute magistrate court warrants for arrest. Magistrate court bailiffs might use reasonable force to gain entry and collect unpaid criminal fines, but this is only done as a last resort. Typically, they will employ a locksmith to gain peaceful entry, and you'll be responsible for covering the locksmith's cost. In general, bailiffs are rarely allowed to force entry, regardless of the type of court order that they possess. The only exceptions are when collecting unpaid criminal fines, unpaid income tax, or unpaid stamp duty. In certain situations, a bailiff may peacefully force entry to seize goods as part of a controlled goods agreement that you have signed. You are not obligated to let magistrate court bailiffs inside your home. It is your legal right to keep your door locked and refuse them entry. If you choose to communicate with them, you can do so through your letterbox or by speaking to them from an upstairs window. Remember, magistrate court bailiffs cannot climb through open windows. They can only enter through a door. However, keep in mind that bailiffs may seize a vehicle owned by the debtor if it's parked outside the home and if it's not under a financial agreement. You can stop a magistrate court bailiff by agreeing to pay the debt that you owe or by working out a repayment plan with them. In certain circumstances, such as having a mental illness, being a single parent or being vulnerable, you may apply to stop a bailiff from visiting. Seek guidance from organisations like Citizens Advice or a debt charity for support in preventing bailiffs visiting based on these reasons. Remember, understanding your legal rights and taking appropriate action can help you effectively deal with magistrate court bailiffs. Stay informed and seek professional advice if you find yourself in a challenging situation. If you're struggling with debt, then there are a number of debt solution options available here in the UK. Some are free to use and others include fees, and each of them will have their own pros and cons. If you want to learn more about the solutions available, then we've created a really great form that you might be interested in checking out. Click the link in the description below to get started and answer a few simple multiple choice questions, like the total amount of your debt, how many people you owe, your living situation, and we'll connect you with one of our trusted partners so that you can find out more and take steps towards improving your financial situation.